What's up you guys? This is Adam. But of course you already knew that. And here I am bringing you a Express HQ gameplay. And I'm using the Spectre Rapid Fire and how that guy got there that quickly, no idea. Must have just spawned there somehow. But this is a Spectre Rapid Fire Scavenger Pro Steady Aim Pro and Marathon. So now I have Marathon Pro. I don't play Capture the Flag. Uh well, actually, on the Express playlist, all you ever seem to play is Capture the Flag, so <laughs> who knows, I might end up with it eventually. This is a very, uh, what I thought was entertaining gameplay, I was very impressed with myself after I got this. Because, to be honest, I don't really use the Spectre. The only submachine gun I really use is the AK-74 for demolition sometimes, and the MP5. Other than that, I don't really use any SMGs, but this gun is something special, I am, I am not going to lie. It seems like as a, considering even when you put rapid fire on it, the recoil doesn't seem that bad. And uh, I will say something about this gameplay, you will notice that a few people were not playing for quite a bit of this game, and you will notice that when you see the scores at the end, it's, it's quite embarrassing when you look at their scores compared to all of our teams. I am playing in a party, because if you don't play express in a party, then, you know, it's all going to go wrong, and you will get frustrated very easily, just like playing normal team deathmatch or something with all the ghost bitches and second chance but anyway that's enough about the gameplay as I'm sure the main talking point for the next maybe week or so in the whole community will be the Call of Duty XP event which is it looks really good of what they're doing with it I mean obviously the people who are actually there can't talk about it yet because you know, that's that's what they've been told. They can't say anything until later on. But I'm sure once everything is once everything is uh, all clear and they can talk about whatever they want, I'm sure everyone's either going to be impressed or um, thinking about not buying the game because there have been some very debatable things that have been uh, posted in videos that have apparently been true. And some people are saying they're not, but you know, everyone's got their own opinion. Like the video Woody's gamer, the Woody's gamer tag put up. He posted information about perks and stuff, and that video got copyrighted and taken down by Activision, which then uh, posed the question: Was that information completely true then? Because you cannot take down a video if. You cannot take down a video for copyright reasons if the information isn't true. You can file a slander report, say that they're giving false information, but you can't file a copyright report if the information is not true, right? Right? So, if everything Woody's Gamertag said is true, then we know an awful lot about the game already, and some things people do not seem happy with, so let's hope they change it. Because obviously they still do have time to change it. So with the things that are wrong with the game, let's hope they do because I don't think anyone would want another modern what the fuck 2 going on because I don't think many people enjoyed that game for its entire lifespan I think some people played it, got bored, got annoyed, went off played COD 4, COD 5 until they got hacked and then went to Black Ops for a bit, noticed all the ghosts and second chance came back to modern what the fuck 2 and then that ended up well, I, I didn't even know, it just it ended up being a massive bitch fest, bitch barrel, pro pipe, commando lunging round corners through walls and whatever fest. It, it just didn't work really, so we're all hoping that this Modern Warfare 3 will hopefully be a great game like it is expected to be. I mean, that's what everyone's hoping, but, you know, everyone was hoping that all Call of Duty games after COD 5 were going to be great, because... I really enjoyed COD 5, I thought it was probably the best COD game I've ever played, and ever since then, it has slowly slid off the scale of how bad a game can be. Actually, saying that, Modern Warfare 2 hit rock bottom, and Black Ops, for me personally, brought it back up slightly. And it, it's definitely it's definitely made it a bit better now with the Express playlist, but come on, why put Capture the Flag in Express playlist, really? It is... It's potentially the worst game mode ever. It's so horrible. I mean, Express Playlist should 
it, it should only be realistically because it's express the express express it should be team deathmatch domination maybe and maybe headquarters or demolition but capture the flag that's I don't I don't I don't even understand I'm not gonna rant about it for too long but another thing I think they should introduce is a express free for all because I know people like playing free for all because it's obvious there's obvious reasons why you can't trust your team on black ops so if they brought an express they brought an express free for all then uh I think it'd make the game much more enjoyable as well. And uh sorry for that little pause there. Just had to close my door. Mysteriously opened. And here comes my dog, I can hear him. Anyway. <coughs> sorry. So with the Call of Duty XP event, the what's going on with it is they are going to be showing a full multiplayer reveal, as I'm sure you already know, and that's pretty pretty brave move showing absolutely everything about the multiplayer. I mean, they must be pretty confident with it to show absolutely everything. And hopefully they have a reason to be confident. And here's some guy not playing. Um, interesting, looking at the wall. Must have been reading something, sorry about that. As you can see, our team is dominating this game. Just thought I'd put that out there. Uh, so yeah, full multiplayer reveal. So hopefully they have a right to be confident with the game because oh, I really hope it's a good game. Otherwise, might have to be another year of Black Ops, and I don't know. I don't know, I don't know if my blood pressure could put up with that. I'm only 15. Bloody hell. I don't think my blood pressure could cope with that. But, uh. Let's hope. Let's, let, fingers crossed, lads. Fingers crossed. And girls, obviously. Fingers crossed. And, uh, other than the full multiplayer reveal, they have other things going on, like the. the sumo wrestling and stuff like that. That seems pretty weird, and. Hold that thought, guys. I'll be right back. My phone is ringing. Right, sorry about that, you guys. Uh, <laughs> my phone was ringing at possibly the worst moment ever. Uh, now I've lost my train of thought. And I've just realised I feel like a right knobhead now because I, I've had my TV on this entire commentary and it was quite loud. So you've probably been able to hear the IAAF Athletics World Championships going on in the background all the time I've been talking to you, for which I apologise. I feel like a right douchebag now, but I've completely lost my train of thoughts. Oh yes, sumo wrestling. That seems like the biggest laugh in the world. It is what they're doing is they're having sumo wrestling in juggernaut suits. That is, and this is a fail. That was a fail. But the sumo wrestling in juggernaut suits. How awesome does that sound? I mean, like, like people have said. It's actually people sumo wrestling, but in the actual juggernaut suit, like when you're playing uh, Spec Ops and stuff like that. That actual juggernaut suit, people will be wearing that, and it seems like such a good laugh. I mean, I'd love to see people like Sam 5000 and Trout wrestling each other in a juggernaut suit, pushing each other out of a sumo ring. That would be, that would be hilarious. It really would. That would that would make my trip if I ever was lucky enough to go to a COD XP event or any event like that. I mean that that's so cool. And here's another guy. Oh, that's the same guy not playing. Sat in a corner. That's some other guy not playing. Sat in a corner. Two free kills. Thank you very much. So other than other than the sumo wrestling multiplayer reveal, it just seems like a general good time. I mean, a lot of YouTubers are there, so I'm sure there will be endless amounts of content being posted <clears throat> and I am quite sure that some others will be disappointed and some others will be quite pleased depends on who you are how you play the game and whatever is announced really so it's definitely going to disappoint some and it's definitely going to impress others it will impress some right immensely and it will impress some just like eh, sounds playable not too amazing but we'll see how it goes and that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking I'm going to be quite impressed. Like, I'll play it for a while, then I might get a bit bored and go off, or maybe bored or a bit frustrated. But I think gen generally the game is going to be quite a big success. I mean, obviously it's going to be a success because it's the biggest first-person shooter game out there. And it probably always will be, unless Battlefield 3 produces something absolutely immense. It's going to have to be something extremely special, but... I don't know if it's going to be good enough either way, because it's a big, it's a big ask 
to not call of duty off the top step but to be honest I think it's a first person shooter it's meant to be fun if you can have fun playing it it doesn't matter which is more popular whichever one you have more fun playing you play it there's no need for this massive flame war about which call of duty well which call of duty is better which console is better battlefield 3 or call of duty there's no need for it whichever you have most fun on whichever you whichever you play most whichever you just generally think is better in your opinion you stick by it and don't start a flame war because they are very frustrating so with that guys this game has virtually ended call him a blackbird right at the end of the game and that was the game we will show you the scores and they are quite embarrassing my score is 48 and 3 and our team score compared to theirs is quite embarrassing almost but thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video bye